episodes on this tape are What Will Little Bear Wear, Hide and Seek, Little Bear Goes to the Moon, and Gone Fishing. Also includes an extra um, with an interview with Maurice Sendak. The 16th week of 1997. And this has the white screen death stack and a mowing sound at the end due to being recorded in EP mode. As most of these little bear tapes up until one of them will be in that speed. Very second week of 1998. And yeah, copyright says 1998. And this has a widescreen death only. Interestingly enough, this tape has the uh, Mac original copy protection, while this uh, version of that tape does not. Also, yeah, there are some differences on the back. The Wall logo is also featured on 98 one, but not the 97 print. The yeah, next volume will also be like that. Episodes on this tape are Pudding Hill, Far Flying Flapjacks, Little Bear in the Wind, and Dr. Little Bear. Also, this is another interview Marie Sendak. This is the first Little Bear tape that I got before I started getting shooting the show. This one was also printed in the 16th week of 1997, and this also has a widescreen death stack and a morning sound at the end. Again, this this version of tape is not copy protected, but this one is. Again, there are differences, but not going to really read them this time. So you can see this one says 1999 to copyright. The 48th week of 1999. Same week in your code as Josh's copy of uh, Mahogany. The one that has that widescreen death one second. But it just has a normal widescreen death at the end. Yeah. Yes, this is a screener tape. In yeah, interestingly enough, uh, this Family Tales and some of the other Little Bear tapes have episodes that are now released onto like American like DVD, which is pretty interesting. Probably Canadian releases had these episodes on DVD, but. I think I'd just rather have the American printings of these. It says EP, Astral P Mail, but this is an SP. The 26th week of 1997. And of course, this has a no preview since the demo tape. Now, here's the actual retail release. Oh, episodes are Snowball Fight, Winter Solstice, Snowbound, and Little Bear in the North Pole. Second week in 1999. And yeah, of course, this has the widescreen death at the end. So I'm not really going to say that it has the widescreen death because pretty much all the other Little Berry Pimo tapes have that. And same week in Yerko is my copy of Lever's Window. Sing along to Ligra and Lindy. Spine is a bit uh, beat up, but that's okay. Tapes are worse. Episodes are Duck Babysitter, Pari Owl's House. Putting up Picnic on Pudding Hill and Little Bear Sweet Tooth. This is a reprint. 41st week of 1999 has the uh, Blue Sides barcode. It is kind of damaged at the end, but that's okay. Episodes are Under the Covers, The Campfire Tale, Up All Night, and Night Full Moon. 41st week of 1998. Episodes are Emily's Visit, I'll Be You, You'll Be Me, Lucy Needs a Friend, and Princess Duck. For some reason, the Panama Copyright says 1998, you know, this tape was released on January 12th, 1999. 
51st week in 1998, so it's an earlier pressing. Somebody name of Hall PC used to own this, but it's mine now. Again, the side's a little beat, but that's okay. Episodes are Caterpillars, Fall the Leader, Little Bear's Mermaid, and Hop Frog Pond. I want guess this has the Nick Jr. Frogs bumper beginning. Similar to the Blues Clues, Arts and Crafts, and ABC's and 123's tapes, which were released before this. Also weird how Piano Copyrights is 1998, even on the back it says 1999. But this is for 1999, obviously. The 19th week of 1999. This is the actual release. Episodes are Goblin Knight, Moonlight Serenade, House Scare Ghost, and Thunder Monster. Thirty second week in nineteen ninety nine, and it has the blue sides barcode. Now here's another copy. Also, it's the Hall PC thing. As you can see, a tape is in is red instead of. Uh, orange and the parent logo and this one has a Vicon byline but this one does not and this is a Columbia House copy because it says CHG right there print date November 4th 1999 and yeah since the Columbia House copy it has no previews going straight to the Paramount feature presentation bumper with the Paramount is voiceover rather than the and now we're voiceover oh that was the last tape to use a Nick Jr. station ID bumper this is the first one to use a Nick Jr. Kids bumper. Episodes are Painting, The Kiss, The Wang, and Valentine's Day. And uh, Lil Vera's voice actually uh, reads the uh, tile, all the tiles on this episode, unlike all the other tapes where he does not. So that's kind of interesting. Cobra says 1999, this is released on January 11th, 2000, but it's printed the 51st week of 1999. Now, this is the last Little Bear tape to record in EP mode. Episodes are Little Bear Sings a Song, D Diva Hen, or Diva Hen, Clever Cricket, and Little Bear's Band. The sixth week of 2000. Used to have a copy as per in the seventh week of 2000, but got rid of it and placed it with the new copy. Now onto the Little Bear Tapes that record in SP mode. Episodes are The Rainy Dance, Play, Hiccups, Mitzi's Mess, and The Puddle Jumper. Has a blue lining sticker label. I think original pranks have the regular label. Put in the 46th week of 2000, there are two barcodes for some reason. And yeah, this tape is recycled because of that. Episodes are Little Sherlock Bear, Duck Lose or Quack, Exploring, and Detective Little Bear. It says EP is also SLP, but this is obviously in SP mode. Copyright says 2000, but this was released on February 6, 2001. Fourth week of 2001. All the, all the episodes on this were actually from uh, 1999. Oh, I actually forgot to... I forgot to get that. Uh, This is a, a 2000 uh, direct-to-video feature. And it's Ray G and it's 75 minutes. This is the only Little Bear production to use the uh, 1995 Nirvana logo as for some reason all the uh, Little Bear episodes that are even ones in 1999 still use the A6 one. Print the 26th week of 2001. This was actually released in Canada by Paramount, unlike the episode ones that were released by Alliance Atlantis. So, yeah. Spine here's a bit faded, but that's okay. Episodes are Simon Says, Marbles, Playball, and I Spy. 
Now to the ones that have the black tapes. 40th week of 2001. For some reason, the episodes on this all the way up to uh, Snack Time Tales have, were never released on American DVD for some reason. Making them VHS exclusive in, that, in, this, in the territory. Episodes are a little bear's walkabout, a painting for Emily, a family portrait, and a thing of Mar Bear. Again, Spine here is a bit of fade, but that's fine. 2001, but it's released on January 29th, 2002. 51st week of 2001. But uh, Nick K. Powell copyright does say 2002 on it, I think. This is the only release to have the uh, 1999 Nirvana logo besides the film. The only episodic release, to be exact. The episodes are The Camp Out, Captain Little Bear, Top of the World, and Whale of a Tail. Um, even though the normal Paramount logo is seen on the uh, case, the 90th anniversary logo is seen on the label, but it still uses the regular Paramount Future presentation rather than the 90th anniversary version. 15th week of 2002. The back here is, a, is dirty, but that's okay. Episodes are Little Bear and the Cupcakes to Grandma's House, Birthday Soup, and Gingerbread Cookies. Once again, pair on 9th anniversary, but it still has a regular feature presentation version. 30th week of 2002. And this is the last uh, Little Bear tape from Paramount that I have. And the last ever release, release one. Episodes are Between Friends, Pillow Hill, which is repeated in Parties and Picnics. Or, it was repeated from an earlier release. I don't... Was it... Was it that one? No, no, it was a, no, it was a different one. Uh, Little Bear Sweet Tooth and the, and the Flu. Little Bear Sweet Tooth was actually repeated from uh, Parties and Picnics, believe it or not. Here's a tape. Yeah, there's a lot of blank film in the end. Almost like, almost the amount of the actual tape itself. Put in the 36th week of 2003. And somebody named Woodsy's on this, but it's mine now. Now to the three uh, Reader's Digest Little Bear tapes I have. This has Little Bear Goes to Moon, Polar Bear, Grandpa Zack, and Duck Soup. Little Bear Goes to Moon is from uh, Me Little Bear. All three of these are from 2002. But all are reprints. July 15th, 2003. Episodes are Between Friends, which is from Feel Better Little Bear. Birthday Soup, which I thought was from... It was from an early release, I thought. Invisible Little Bear and Daily Iron Wish. Was, was it from? Yeah, it was from Sock Time Tales. Birthday Soup was from Sock Time Tales. Top is like that, but that's all right. July 16th, Season 3, so one day after the Pretend Time tape. And the last Little Bear tape I have for now... Has Little Bear's Trip to the Stars Gone Fishing, which again was from uh, Me Little Bear, Little Bear's Kai and Pillow Hill, which again was from uh, Me Little Bear. This one was sealed when I got it. September 22nd, 2003, so two months after the other two, we have Digest Tapes. So yeah, that's it for this collection video, and peace out.